this is another rare wreath. I just finished making this it, uh, pretty late in the morning. Um, I wanted to see if I could uh, produce something out of uh, uh, a different type of branch style, so I did. This, uh, it's kind of hard to tell. I'm going to try to put the, uh, the wreath closer to the camera. Um, this is made out of uh, laurel, mountain laurel. So this is a mountain laurel wreath. It's a rare wreath. You see other wreaths similar, maybe. Uh, no. <laughs> uh, this is a, a mountain laurel wreath. It's a branch wreath. It's a rare wreath. You usually won't see any of these anyway. Um, I enjoy making wreaths. Um, no one taught me uh, this specific style of wreaths. I, I read and, st and, and looked at... Uh, um, different reed practices uh, that had disappeared and I began to experiment in the, the woods with uh, trees and tree branches specifically. That is what uh, caused me to be able to produce what you see in front of you here. Um, this is uh, mountain laurels. Uh, as you can look at it, I mean really you could hang this um, you could probably hang this any, you know, you could, you could hang it top heavy, like this. Let me see here. Move it back a little bit. Or, you could hang it, uh, top light. So, um, I like to wear these, actually. Let's put this on. So, so, uh, move it down a little bit. It's not typical. Uh, I spin it a little bit here. There we go. Small side of. Uh, It's not a typical piece of uh, jewelry. <laughs> it's a Appalachian mountain laurel leaf. Uh, there's no leaves on it. <laughs> it's an Appalachian mountain laurel wreath. So I'm glad to share it with you. Uh, I'm glad to uh, wear it with you. If you want to, let me see, get a close up. This is it. Uh, until the next one. Um, I make many wreaths and I'll show those different ones on here. Um, I plan on uh, having another wreath share probably within a couple of days. Uh, maybe even tomorrow night. Who knows? Or tomorrow morning. 